Why am I pretending to know what this is? I would have loved to have been given all of my teeth. I don't know about you guys. I'm kind of a little bit of a weirdo like that. The time has come, my friends, to open this package. <laughs> it's been sitting in our living room for like four days and it's taken everything in me not to open it because I wanted to film it because it was almost like I was drunk ordering these things because mom brain, like I have no idea what's actually in this package. I think there's a couple shirts for me. There's some bath toys for Harlow and I'm not sure what else I bought. I spent just under a hundred dollars and I wanted to see what the hype was about. There are so many things on there that are just like, I've actually bought like the same thing like on Amazon, but for triple the price. So I'm pretty excited about this. Um, I am excited to see if it is like kind of like a scam or not. Like, did I get everything in here? Is everything that I ordered in here? I guess I wouldn't really know. I'd have to look back at my, um, email because I honestly don't really remember what I ordered <laughs> beyond what I just told you. So let's go through this. Let's open it up and see what I got. I think I got like a good variety of stuff if I'm not mistaken. I don't remember if I got any kitchen stuff, but I'm also wondering if Timu is owned. I don't even know if that's how you say it. I'm wondering if this is owned by Shein um, because it's very, very similar. So I mean, let's open it up and see see what we got in here. It's been a long time coming. Some of the kids stuff on here looked really, really cute. And I know you might be thinking $100 was a lot to spend on here, but for me, like I had so much stuff in my cart that I actually narrowed it down and was like, let me lower this dollar amount. It's crazy how much it adds up, right? It's like $2 here, $3 here. It's always what I try to tell my mom, that shit adds up. Um, Nick's taking, <laughs> Nick's installing um, a light up mirror in the other room. And I think, I, I don't know if my bathroom tour and like moving into my bathroom will be live when this goes up, but if not, I will. If, if it is, I'll link it. And if it's not, subscribe and make sure you turn on bell notifications so you know when it's up because he's installing a light up mirror I have in there. Okay, <laughs> here's what we have. <laughs> I'm so excited to see all this stuff. Oh, my lower back's been kind of hurting today. Woo, I'm almost 38 weeks pregnant, y'all. Um, okay, actually by the time you see this, I will be 38 pregnant, 38 weeks pregnant. Okay, so I got, okay, so now that I'm looking at this, I got some kind of like Montessori type toys. Here is one of them. So it's like a little toy jail and they can like pull them out and put them back in. So let's open this and see what it looks like. One of my friends just purchased a bunch of, this is so cute. This is adorable. One of my friends just purchased a bunch of clothing for her daughter and it like, she's loving it. Um, these are really cute. I'm gonna lose all of these. The cats are actually gonna start playing with these, but this is a really cute concept and looks adorable. So. We'll see what Harlow thinks. Like after we film looking at all of it, we'll show some of it to her. I don't want to overwhelm her, but I'll give her one or two items and see what she thinks. Also Harlow's nanny uh, purchased, she heard that I did. And so she purchased some stuff and she already got her package. I want to say it took about a week to get to me after I ordered it, which isn't too bad. And she did, took advantage of like the like, buy three items, get like seven free or whatever. I kind of just ignored all of that because I didn't want to pay attention to the fine print or like what they were trying to sell to me. So I just got what I wanted, but she took advantage of that and actually got quite a bit of stuff. And she also got like electronic stuff. She got like an electric toothbrush, a hair dryer, and some different things like that. So she said that it all works. She said she doesn't know how long it's gonna last, but she's like the hair dryer you can kind of tell is like cheap, but it was like it's, it was free. So um, that could be really good for like a hospital bag if you need, you know, just like a small mini blow dryer or something and you don't really care if it only lasts a couple times. Um, okay. <laughs> this I got for the bath. Harlow desperately needs bath toys. She, poor girl, has been like playing with the same bath toys since she was born. Um, and she is 14 months. So let's open this and see. It's always really hard to tell like, how big something is. But I will say that the review pictures are pretty helpful on the website. Okay, that's everything. 
How cute. Even that is just cute. I love it. Um, okay, let's see. So, oh, there's the suction cups. So you put the suction cups on the back and then you take the water and you pour it over it and all these little like pieces like move and stuff and you like stick it on the bathroom or the bathtub like wall or whatever and like all the little so if that actually works that's pretty cute that's super cute though that's kind of about like the size that i thought it was gonna be like i wish it was like double that size but hey um it was cheap <laughs> Okay, this was super cute. It's not really my like color aesthetic, but whatever. So this is a game, I guess. It's like a memory game. Why am I pretending to know what this is? I thought you just pulled the radishes out of here and that was that, but it's saying it's a memory game. So I don't know if you're supposed to be like, okay, pull the blue one out or, you know, there isn't a blue one, of course. Um, pull the red one out and then like you do that. So I don't, I don't, I don't really know. Let's not pretend anymore. Let's just open it and see. It is a little game comes with some little stickers. You have like little cards that tell you like what to pull or something. I'll read through this later, but um, <laughs> this is cute. So here's the little thing and the little guys and you like stick them in there and then you can pull them out. All these little like radish pieces and then the sticker of the farmer goes on here and i got you zero <laughs> i don't think i got you anything you know what the coolest fruit in the world is avocado a radish <laughs> so dumb. this is kind of cool though huh look at this thing she can like she like pulls them out of here oh, yeah that's cool it was like three dollars nice. and this goes on the little bath side and pour water and like all the little things move and stuff. Hmm. Cool. Super cool. So let's see what else we got. Oh, this is cute. This is a bath toy too. Oh, my freaking lower back is killing me. Ugh. Fishing net that looks like a little shark. And you got these little, like this is a little walrus and an octopus and a whale and a shark and a starfish and it's just like a little cute like bath toy for her to like good for like i don't know motor skills like trying to pick stuff up with the little basket or the little net i just thought it was super cute so that one's pretty pretty basic okay <laughs> these are like you might think these are creepy but i actually thought they were pretty cool and i'm a little behind now on harlow so hopefully i can guess but these are little tooth fairy boxes and it came in a set of these little guys and what they are is so it looks like this and then you open it and then you can write in here your child's information and you can put like when and at what age the teeth came in and then when they fall out you put them in here and this is like kind of soft and so you can actually give them their teeth and store them for them and like give them their teeth when they're older. Like I would have loved to have been given all of my teeth. I don't know about you guys. I'm kind of a little bit of a weirdo like that, but I would have greatly appreciated if my parents were like, here's your teeth that we saved for you. It came in a set of two. So I got a blue one and a pink one. Um, you didn't get to choose your colors, but I thought these, we're really cute. <laughs> Look, it came with like little tweezers. Do you guys keep your kids' teeth or do you throw them away? Like where, where, where do you, where do you, where does you, what, what do you do? Like, I just, I just would like to keep them. I think it'd be cool. Oh, this is fun. This thing lights up. Hopefully it comes with batteries or something. It's feeling really light. Wait, how does it work? <laughs> so it's hard to tell in here because it's so um bright but this is for the bath and you can turn the lights off or turn them down and this is just supposed to be fun for them to like find in the bath um you could probably play with it in the pool too i don't see why not you just press this little button and it turns it on and off <laughs> it's super cute more bath toys oh my gosh i forgot i got these they're so cute these are so 
freaking adorable. Um, I don't know if these are gonna fit her though. They look a little small. I did my best, but look how cute those are. They're like little baby skull moccasins. These are absolutely adorable. It has a little Velcro. Um, yeah, I don't know if these are gonna fit her. Oh, I got a, um, a latex bib. We, like a catch-all type of bib. We pretty much use these every time she eats. So I got one of these because I wanted to keep one in her diaper bag because I'm always grabbing like a little mat for her when we go out to eat and like one of these. Because if we're at someone's house or we're at a restaurant and she doesn't have one of these, my pregnant ass is always on the floor sweeping up and cleaning up all of the food. And um, I used to be a server, so I know. <laughs> so I clean it up, but like this makes my job a lot easier. This is very, very thin compared to the other ones that we have, which is fine as long as she doesn't try to pull it off her neck, which she does love to do. So um, we'll see how this works out. But yeah, thin, but uh, effective, hopefully. This is super basic. I'll spare you guys opening this, but it's pretty much just like a little bath caddy to stick to the wall that comes with these guys so that I can put all of her toys in there and kind of get them off of the ground of the bathroom. Um, a lot of times they get left in the bottom of the bathtub. So just something to organize like her shampoo and conditioner. She doesn't have conditioner. What the fuck am I talking about? <laughs> she hardly has any hair. Her shampoo and like her body wash and like all that good stuff. So yeah. I'm excited to put this up because I've been really kind of annoyed by the toys just like all over the place in there. Next, we have a shirt that I bought for myself. Let's see. Okay, so far this is extremely soft. I was not expecting that. <laughs> Let's see what it says, I forgot. Oh my gosh, this is so freaking cute. Look how adorable this is. This is so cute. This is a large, by the way. So just to give you like a little frame of reference. This is a large and it's like the beige color. I think that they had it in white too, but it might've been sold out. Um, it's really cute. This, uh, this is so freaking soft. I did not expect like anything from this site to be freaking soft. And like, I wanna sleep in this right now. This is, this is as soft as the pajamas I'm wearing. This is like legitimately super, super soft. I feel like this is like a, such a cute site for like little stocking stuffers or like even like a baby shower. Like this would be so cute to give to someone for at their baby shower with like some other like little, you know, like little things like these, like just because a baby toy is like more expensive doesn't mean that it's like better, you know? That's not always the case. Mostly toys just, mostly kids just wanna play with like the shit you're throwing away. So anyways, I, I love this. I'm loving this so far. <laughs> I bought this for the baby, although this is giant. Feeling cute, might shit myself later. <laughs> I think this is so freaking cute. It's very wide. Um, like, like I could put this on Harlow and lengthwise this would fit her, but widthwise it's super wide. So maybe I'll just put that on Harlow <laughs> because that's kind of big. Oh yes. So I got this little guy. It is like a little snack container. I thought this would be really good for taking out and about with us for snacks. Now, someone did bring up a really good point today. Um, it was Har Harlow's nanny. She was like, I don't know if there's BPA in this stuff and I don't either. So I need to like kind of look that up, but um, I feel like most of the like baby type stuff like this that I buy like home goods and whatnot is like from China anyways. So, but I don't know, this is super cute. Um, feels like pretty like, you know, good quality. Like this doesn't feel like it's gonna break like anytime soon or anything. I wouldn't put it in the dishwasher, but um, this is cute to take traveling with us or in the car or, or down to the beach, like whatever. Um, so. Yeah, that's super cute. I'm really interested to see about this necklace. So I bought this necklace, I thought it was super, super cute. And I was like, I am interested to see if there's like a like a jewel missing or something when I get it. It's actually really freaking cute. Okay, let me put this on the string so you guys can see it. This is so freaking adorable. I'm sure it like won't last forever, but I don't know. You guys may or may not know this about me, but I typically wear pretty cheap jewelry or I buy nice jewelry at a smoking deal on Nordstrom Rack 
and someone asked me where this ring is from. They saw it in my like nail video and it's not for sale anymore, but I got it at Nordstrom Rack. This is so cute. Can you guys see that? Is it in focus? How cute is that? There are three items left, so bear with me. This is another t-shirt, let's see how soft it is. Not anywhere near as soft as the other one, that's for sure, what does this say? Oh, <laughs> overstimulated mom's club. I think this is so cute, what size is this? Yeah, this is an extra large, um, so it'll fit me right now, but I thought this was super, super, super cute. I like the design, it's definitely like, not like the top quality like screen printing and this fabric is definitely feels like almost like a like an athletic kind of shirt fabric but um definitely not as soft as the other one but i wouldn't say it's rough uh by any means and i did also hear through the grapevine that timu is like really good with returns so if you have to return anything or you want to return anything i heard that they're like really good about it <sighs> two things left okay so these are bralettes i bought uh Apparently I bought, <laughs> like I remember, I bought these little bralettes. I don't know if my tits are gonna fit in these. Um, it's a set of the gray, the nude, and the like sage green. And they're pretty soft. They Honestly, they just feel like, like free people, like bra material, like, you know what I mean? The only difference here is that they, from some bras is that they don't have like a clasp here. You just kind of are gonna put it on over your head, I guess but it does have the little adjustable strap. So I bought these with the intention of being able to quickly like whip a boob out to breastfeed. But I mean, I just love a good bra, like a bralette like this that you can just kind of wear with other things too. And it doesn't have to specifically only be for breastfeeding. So, I mean, from what I'm seeing so far, so far so good. I, th I think this was like, I don't even remember how much these were, but um these are what size these are a medium and i may actually need a large right now with this belly but a medium i think would fit me after i pop the baby out so yeah so far these are pretty cool last but not least this is a little dress that i got for harlow she freaking loves dinosaurs anytime she sees a dinosaur she goes Rawr. <laughs> um what sound does a dinosaur make? Uh, wow. Wow, wow. Oh my gosh, it's adorable. It's very soft. So this is the tw uh, 12 to 18 month little dinosaur dress. And it's just really simple. It's got the little frilly arms. It's super soft. It's probably made out of polyester. Yeah, 95%. So it doesn't breathe super well. So wouldn't put it on or on a like scorching day when we're probably going to be standing out in the sun a ton. But um it's a dress, so, you know, whatever. Super cute. There's the fabric up close. Um, and I'm, like, not seeing any holes in it or anything. So, yeah. All right. Overall, I have to say I'm pretty 10 out of 10 stoked on this purchase and everything that I got. I'm, like, not disappointed in one single thing. The one thing that I would say that is, like, the closest to a disappointment is this guy because it's so wide. Um, but other than that, like I'm pretty stoked to try all this out and show it to Harlow. So let's go show her one of the, like, I'm going to, I think I'm going to take, we'll take this one to her and see what she thinks about it. Um, but yeah, overall, I'm pretty stoked on this. Like, what do you guys think? Have you ordered from Timu before? I think you just have to be kind of like maybe smart about what you order um you know what i mean like i just like buy stuff that you that's simple that like can't break that easily i would say i don't know that's my that's my advice but i just see, i got i got kind of a, a little bit of everything i didn't get any kitchen stuff but apparently there's like a lot of like really cute like little ice cube stuff on there I mean, they just like literally have everything. So let me know what your thoughts are on what I got today. Have you purchased before? Like, let me know. Um, but let's go ahead. I don't even know what these are. They're like, oh, do they stack? Oh yeah, they fit into each other. That's cute. But yeah, I mean, I'm pretty stoked on what I got. <laughs> like want to go back on the site and see what else I can buy to like organize my, um, 
bathroom because I just moved all my stuff in there and I was looking on Amazon and a lot of the organizational bins and plastic stuff on there is like actually quite expensive. So I might just hop on Timu and see what kind of like little bathroom organizational stuff I can find on there um, and show you guys organizing that if you wanna see because I definitely like to do things on a budget as you know. So um, without further ado, let's go see what Harlow thinks of her new toy. Harlita! Sorry to interrupt. Yeah, she can like pull the like little things through it and like put them back and they stack. What's that? <laughs> Matches your carpet colors. Oh, right in the mouth. The entire thing? Are you kidding me? Ooh. Oh, and then the Be careful, please. Yeah, be careful. Take that out of your mouth, honey. Thank you. Wow. Oh. Yeah, put it back in there. Good job. I would say this is a hit so far. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I'm not getting a thank you, so apparently she really likes it because she's very distracted. I keep thinking when I'm ending the vlog and then I don't. Um, I just wanted to show you guys. I just put this shirt on. It doesn't stay rolled up on the sleeve super well because of the kind of fabric. It feels kind of like a sports kind of fabric, um, which isn't the most comfortable, but it's super cute. I think once I wash it, it'll kind of like loosen up a little bit, um, but pretty cute. And I have to show you Harlow's little dinosaur dress. It's on her right now. It's like so cute because we're gonna go to dinner. Here we are. These are those jeans that I got at Ross recently, if you watched that video. So this is the full little fit going on. And then Harlow's playing in the bathtub over here. <laughs> oh, you're like in your potty. Okay. Do you need some help? <laughs> Do you need some help? Yeah, but <laughs> it's not. You're, you're sitting on it backwards, honey. Let's see your dinosaur dress. Let's see your dress. I think that's as good as we're gonna get, folks. What happened to your cute little pink headband that I had? You were like, no, no thanks, mom. You're so cute. Yeah, mama's gonna need that. Mama needed this after you came out, but didn't have it. <laughs> you ready to go get some dinner?